fact, we caught up with three actual regular comedians of the Norwich comedy circuit to find out just how it feels playing for laughs. Here at the Redneck Comedy Club, we have a different character influential on the Norwich comedy scene. I came um, to Norwich to work at UEA. I was a lecturer for about 11 years. For a long time, I quite liked to do comedy because uh, you'd be surprised how similar lecturing is to doing comedy. And uh, I went to a comedy workshop and uh, I decided I'd, I'd like to give it a shot. We only ask one thing of you. We work hard to do comedy here and we ask that you work hard on your head. I'm born in North Carolina in the States. Uh, I worked in law enforcement and uh, I kind of had enough and thought well, I wanted to get out and venture a bit and I ended up in Norwich and it's just like home. All comedians <laughs> remember their first time. I actually planned a gig three, three months ahead and so I spent three months kind of kind of panicking about it and I mean I look back at, at that gig because I filmed it and I can't watch it, it's, it's hard to watch. The first gig I ever did was about five minutes and it was just after the comedy workshop and they, they said, right, you've got five minutes tonight. I thought if I don't do it now, I never will. And, and you'd think that because I'd been a lecturer, because I was used to public speaking, that it would have been fine. And I was shaking, literally shaking with fear before I did it. So what's their advice for Norwich's budding comedians? <laughs> the first time you get up there and you do it, you realise that you can do anything. I mean, if you can stand up in front of a room and try to make them laugh, and then you do it. Well, the world's your street, you can do anything then. I can conquer the world now. I'm thinking of running for president. <laughs> yeah, I am, but as in America, we just call it big bummed. Or my grandmother says, you'll grow into it. 43, I haven't grown yet. Just why? Do it because you love it. Don't do it because you think you're going to make money, because only a few people make money at it. And if, if you love it, keep doing it. When I went to London, I was on my own advice. And the cab driver asked me where I was from, and I said Norwich. And he went, well, he heard a Norwich accent in a long time. <laughs> <laughs> I said, you still ain't. <laughs>